just a visual glitch. Just give her a second. Would you like to save? No. Yes. <laughs> save. Yay. Through the room of worms. April 1930, the Unlucky Cloverfield. So That's something's not disturbing at all. No, it's a completely normal. I don't know what you're talking about. And now for bondage. Those ropes are way too high up on her shoulders and a little bit too loose. She should be able to just shrug out of them pretty easily. Well, the girl is not. Keep moving. Escape. <laughs> Make the vaguely sexual noises of moving around. <laughs> when the girl awoke, she found herself in a strange room making orgasmic sounds as she moves around. Well, it was a cold, lonely, stinky room. Now I'm just stuck. <sighs> Yeah, but don't those sounds sound, it just sounds wrong. Yeah, somebody was obviously a- Good morning, Jennifer. How do you feel? Fuck you. Let's have a little chat, shall we? No, go to hell. It's up to you. No, it doesn't matter which way she is. Yeah. Oh, so that's how you feel, is it? Yes. <laughs> You kidnapped us, Jennifer, bondaged us, and tied us to a thing. Bad, bad girl. And bad girls need to be punished, don't they? Nope, not at all. No. A bad, bad girl who's not sorry, hmm? <laughs> anyway, I'll be the one giving the orders around here, okay? No. Oh, silly girl. You still don't understand. You can probably stretch your legs will out. Will you? Right? Will before long. Oh, okay. Now, I'm going to give you your first order. Every month you need to find a gift and bring it to the aristocrat club. No, I'll keep the gifts myself. don't, I'll kill you. No. Is there anything about this that you don't understand? Um, is there anything about this you don't understand? Yes. No. Hmm. Oh well. It doesn't really matter what you say. You see, Jennifer, there are really only two kinds of people in the world. Those who take orders, and those who give them. And from now on, I'll be giving the orders. Not fair? Well, dear Jennifer, nothing's fair here. <laughs> You will follow my orders or else. <laughs> For I am the prince and the prince rules. <laughs> so we were just kidnapped and sold into slavery. This is your life, but you'll play by my rules. <laughs> Let the games begin, dear Jennifer. <laughs> I think we need to go pimp slap <laughs> Do you, do you agree, Emily, that we need to go pimp slap a kid? Sure. Oh, shit. Rusty shears! Gonna need some tetanus after this. Seriously, how did those even cut through the rope? As far as you ask. And then the rest of the ropes just fall off of her. And so, the rope was cut. Snip, snip. The girl joined the wrist of cut. Congratulations. I don't know if that's something to be happy about. Yeah. I want the scissors. You can't get the scissors just yet. You need to go get the bucket. So you can so you can give the bucket knight his bucket back. Blackboard is badly smudged in a ledger. Please help me find my head. Once I am whole again, I'll return the favor. I think the bucket, there's the bucket. Bucket? Come here, bucket.
How can he help? He's stationary. Bucket! We now have Bucket Knight. Acquired save point. I'm the Bucket Knight Keeper of Promises. He's so cruel, for I have aged and cannot remember the past. <laughs> However, you do not know from the moment, nor can you remember. Let us recall our memories together in order to remember our promise. It's always creepier when the two of us say it at the same time. Story hints. When you aren't sure how to proceed, talk to the bucket knight and select ask for clues in order to receive a hint about what to do next. You don't need that. You have me sitting right here. <laughs> I will just save, I guess. Save again so you don't have to go through the cutscenes. <laughs> yes. Hate cutscenes. Well, don't hate them. They're actually good, but... They're kind of the point. Where's my dog? You'll get the dog eventually. I just spoiled that, but whatevers. Oh, well, nobody cares. Again, if you are watching this to get a spoiler-free run-through, we will try and keep the spoilers to a minimum, but it's not gonna happen. Nope. Yeah. But you need the scissors for that, but you can't get the scissors yet. I remember. You gotta go see what you gotta give the aristocrat club for today. Oh, creepy. I don't wanna go see them. Yep, you gotta go see the aristocrat club. Because you gotta give them a gift every month or they're going to kill you. Down. Down screen. Yeah. And then to your right. Keep going right. That door. That door, then up the stairs, and you'll be in the first class area, which has uh, the rest track club in it. Ooh. Stairs. So mysterious. Mysterious stairs. Take a peek, shall we? First class guest sector. Hmm. Sounds pleasant. Eh, it's very much, it's much, much more pleasant than the rest of this damn place. The little girl found a strange door, but where does it lead? No one knows. Into the black abyss of your soul. Wee. Oh, more creepy children. Check the box, read the poster. Change boxes attached to the door. That's where you can put stuff in! Ooh. Uh, make an offering, we don't have anything to offer. Read the poster. Gotta figure out what we gotta get them. This month's gift. A beautiful butterfly, one per person. So we need to go find a beautiful butterfly. So quit. Quit. Now where can we find a beautiful butterfly? It needs to be beautiful. <laughs> Stand helplessly. The door is Why is the door speaking? Give me a beautiful butterfly, one per person. Is that clear? No gift, no entry. Is that clear? Give me a butterfly. Give me a butterfly. Find one and you shall be invited to join the aristocrat club. The speaker's barely picking up. Yeah, I know. Oh man, I gotta go find shit. Find a butterfly. Ah, creepy children, go away. Chase them, chase them down. Where chase the children. Butterfly. Find them. Teach them a lesson. They would probably just beat me up. Yeah, Jennifer's kind of a wimp. She was above the clouds! <gasps> Gasp! I'm flying! Oh dear! Hindenburg, gotta crash, set on fire. Kill it with fire. I think it's actually on the other side. Maybe? You're looking, you're looking for the butterfly, which I want to say is on the other side. 
Well, let's go find. Okay. Explore. In... Am I wrong? Nope, I'm wrong. Okay, don't pay attention to me. Open doors. Yeah. If we had the extra stuff, then that would get us. Then I think we can use them. In... No, that's in the other one. Never mind. Since we didn't use my extra file, I don't think we have any of the extra items. Right. Any of, like the outfits, which sucks, but oh well. Probably should have oh, well. thought of that. We'll just have to play in this one and not the octopus costume. This game has beautiful music. Yes, it does. Oh, this is the way that they ran. They ran into the library and locked it. being creepers. I think you have to actually leave the first floor, or leave the first class area. Like, go back to the stairs. I want the soundtrack to this game. Fine, just... Oh, oh, read the sign. Read the sign right in front of you. Social rank, refined classes. Duchess Diana, Countess Eleanor, Baroness Meg, Lower Class, Poor, Poor Amanda, Amanda, Beggar, Beggar Jennifer. Jennifer. They tacked on a new ranking just to give us something at the lowest of the low. Beggar Jennifer. They're so mean! What did we ever do to them? It's the left door. See, that's for aristocrats only. Well, by golly, be that way. That's why there's a sign that says aristocrat. Why can't I be an aristocrat? Why do I have to be a stupid beggar? Because they said so. Apparently. <sighs> Just head back the way you came and I think you come across the butterfly. I just can't get any doors open. Nope, everything's locked. This door's locked. This door needs a key. This lock is jammed. It's like Silent Hill. Oh, cutscene. Butterfly! Emily, it's a butterfly. Must follow the butterfly. Amanda's gonna get it first! No, Amanda! Stupid poor girl. By the way, uh, Amanda is Emily's favorite character? Yep. You'd say? Yep. Amanda's Emily's favorite character. Why is Amanda your favorite character? Because she's creeper. Okay. He looks like he's naked. Well. I think you can go through there now, through there now actually. <laughs> you say Amanda is the creepiest? Well, I, she's just gross. She's not really that creepy. She's just Puppy! A, a really gross. Puppy! Oh no, we must save Puppy. Puppy! Somebody tied up the dog upside down and then covered his face in rope. How nice of them. Must find the room I came in. The room you came in was right behind you. You can't go get the dog anyway yet because you can't get into the room to lower the scissors. Hi! How you doing? Eleanor. The unlucky girl met Eleanor. The princess is cold as ice. Inside the apple room, the princess shot an icy glare and said, Yes, she is a pain. Okay. Okay. Leave you to your chickens. 